Devin Mashker never thought he'd end up fighting fires for free. I'm from Kansas City, so I never even heard of volunteer. I thought it was just all full time. But his experience as a volunteer at Reddings Mill Fire Protection District has been irreplaceable. It's a great experience. You get, um, you get to do some really cool stuff. You got to meet great guys and you get to help out your community. But he's been just one of five volunteers the department has seen in the past year. And according to the U.S. Fire Administration, nearly 73 percent of all Missouri firefighters are volunteer. Previous to that, it was, you know, neighbors wanting to help neighbors. And we don't see that much coming through the door anymore. Chief Coates says there's about 30 to 40 less volunteers today than a decade ago, a trend the whole country is seeing. Ultimately, in 2017, we went to the taxpayers and, and asked for a tax increase uh, to be able to, to hire more paid staff because we just weren't able to recruit and, and retain the volunteers. Recent initiatives in the state aim to recruit veterans to become firefighters. We've had a few veterans come through uh, after they've gotten out of the service. While other legislation looks to give loan forgiveness to those who volunteer. I saw it as an awesome opportunity to get my foot in the door, get my career started. Coates says he's open to anything that can help Reddings Mill and its neighboring agencies get the personnel they need. Some of those agencies only have one or two volunteers during the daytime. It's a real not only a safety hazard to the to the citizens they're serving, but a safety hazard to those responding too. 